Well, hello, Windows fanatics. It's Nick here from Windows Mobile Power User. So, if you've already seen the title of this video, then you know exactly what we're going to talk about today. Continuum. Now, many of you are already owners of the Lumia 950 and 950 XL phones, and you may already know how to use Continuum. Or maybe you don't really know how to use it or even the types of things that it can do. If not, then don't worry. Hopefully this video will solve those burning questions for you and maybe even convince you to run out and buy one. Well, let's go ahead and get right into it. Microsoft is trying to project the Lumia 950 family as a productivity device, mainly because of the Continuum technology inside of it. Consumers who use their current PC for word processing, web surfing, and even designing the company's next presentation can now replace their PC for a Lumia device and you'll get a really similar experience. While it won't replace the full PC experience, it allows a professional to use the Lumia 950 family and the display dock for presentations, mail access, universal apps, and office documents such as Word, Excel, etc. Pretty cool, huh? Now you don't have to lug around a tower or a laptop with you. Now, let's go ahead and take a look exactly how it works. Now, I've connected it to a mouse and keyboard using display dock. And boom! This is exactly how Windows 10 will appear when you connect through a dock. The experience here will be exactly the same as a normal PC. This is not a mirroring feature you can find on an Android device. This is like extending your phone display to another display. You can open the start menu, even open apps in full screen just like you could on a regular PC. If you have a video playing on the big screen, you can still use your phone as well. Pretty nifty! Now, you're probably wondering if Continuum will continue to run smoothly even when under stress. We can definitely find out for you right now, actually. We're gonna run a few tests here, starting with plugging in an additional mouse. If it can handle more than one mouse, this will be a pretty good deal so far. And it works! Now, what about being able to access a mighty 128 gigabyte pen drive? Now that's gonna be a tough one. And it does work. As you can see, I'm able to access the files and do whatever I please with them. Copy them, cutting them, deleting them, renaming them. Anything I can do on a PC, I can do here. Now, our final test is going to be the most stressful of them all. What is it, you ask? Well, how about opening a bunch of programs to see if it crashes? For in the name of science! First, I'm going to open up a video on YouTube. And then I'm going to open up most of Microsoft Office's applications such as Word, PowerPoint, Excel, and more. And now I'm going to switch between them and see just how well they hold up. Dang! Continuum seems to work some sort of magic because it withstood our previously undefeated stress tests. In all serious though, this is an absolutely fantastic feature and it isn't a gimmick like a lot of companies use to sell more units that are supposed to be supported in the future but aren't. I'm looking at you Amazon Fire Phone. Now if you're on the fence about replacing your phone and your PC for a more compact device, then I recommend going for this product. Hey if you like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Maybe even share this video with your friends too if they aren't sure if they want one or not. And if you want to see more of us at Windows Mobile Power User, then hit that subscribe button with the force of a thousand suns.